Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here. Today is actually Monday, Monday morning. I'm waiting for my uh, team call here in a few minutes. But what I ended up doing yesterday was because I had blathered on so much about my weight loss and, and why I'm doing that and all that stuff that I, I didn't want to make like a 20 minute video because we did a lot yesterday. So what I have done is I took parts of the intro of, you know, like when I went to get bagels and I started talking about the, the weight and all that bullshit and everything as yesterday's video. And I also had to use the ending that I had shot yesterday after I left Pleasure House Point. And then I'm like, ah, screw it. I'm just going to use it again tomorrow because, you know, that's kind of what I had to do. I figured I would just shoot this in studio intro just to let you know why you're like seeing the same shit that you saw yesterday. And who knows, maybe I'll just shoot an outro right now. Ultimately, it doesn't really make a difference. We did a lot of shit yesterday. It was an adventure filled day and there was just too much to put into a single video. So even though today I'm getting the 35 G Master and I was going to do an unboxing and show you all that shit uh, for today's video, I think I'm going to use yesterday's stuff for today's video. So kind of like a day behind. But then again, who cares? It's my channel. I can do what I want. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to I'm going to show you everything from yesterday. And I just wanted to give you a little intro and tell you why. And that'll be that. So without further ado, here's all the shit we did yesterday. All right, kids, off to today's great adventure. We are going to Flanagan Farm. Flanagan Farms. We're going strawberry picking. So it's like an 11 mile drive, so we're going to have a nice leisurely scenic drive. And then we're going to pick strawberries because strawberries are good. I'm bringing you along, so let's get there. Okay, kids, here we are at Flanagan Farms. We are picking strawberries. Yeah, here we go. Big juicy strawberry. Okay, that's enough for her, but check this place out. Just big rows, rows upon rows of fresh strawberries to pick. So yeah, we're gonna get us some strawberries like this. Yummy. The little sign says, uh, you know, like you can have a taste, but this isn't a buffet. <laughs> and it is unbelievably pleasant out here. It's probably in between 65 and 70 degrees, a light breeze, pretty much mostly sunny. I mean, there's some cloud cover, but it isn't bad. And it's awesome. It's very, again, this is the time of year where we want to do this kind of stuff before it turns into, you know, 105 with 4,000 humidity. So I'm all about that. And now I'm going to put the camera down so I can actually pick these strawberries. Awesome. I haven't tried one of these things yet, but my wife just did. Oop. But my wife just did. She said it was delicious. So here we go. Gonna taste this. Doesn't look like there's any spiders on it. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God, Francine, these strawberries, these strawberries. Oh my God, Francine, if you know, you know. Holy shit, that is absolutely delicious. Oh, uh, sorry you had to hear me chew, but holy shit, that was absolutely delicious. There is nothing like fresh fruit and fresh vegetables. And this last week has definitely shown me what it's like 
to get rid of all that extra like seasoning and, and saucing and all that stuff and getting back to just the natural taste of things. And every time I do that, I think to myself, God, why did I put all that junk on it? It's so good. That was one of the best strawberries I've eaten in a long time. So I'm gonna go pick more. All right, kids, that was fun, albeit quick. I, I mean, how long does it take to fill up a couple of baskets with strawberries? And you don't wanna get too many because then you just end up throwing them away. But holy shit, I mean, I only ate one. I reserved myself and only had one. And it was amazing. So we're thinking about all the crap we can do with these strawberries probably just gonna sit there and eat them <laughs> but but that was fun and I mean altogether not that expensive I think it was 329 a pound plus you pay a buck for the basket so we, we spent 17 bucks and had some fun and we got some amazing delicious fresh strawberries not store-bought 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 like yellow crunchy unjuicy shit so that was fun. Now we need to take these things home because it's actually pretty warm. Yeah, it's in the 70s now and it wasn't supposed to be. So it, it's too warm in the car to let these things sit. We were going to go to three shifts, but we'll take these home first and then we'll go get caffeinated. So total success. Yay. Well, it's been an adventure filled day. Uh, we went to three shifts. We went to the closer one because it was actually early enough for us to do that. And then there's a thrift store pretty close by that she hasn't been to for a while. So we went in there and, and she looked around and found some deals. And then I thought to myself, well, shit, it's only two o'clock. It's early enough. I, like, I'm not ready to go home and sit inside and, and do laundry and all that shit. So I'm going to Pleasure House Point. Yeah, I'm going to take a loop around there and, and see what I see. It is still a, a freaking gorgeous day. Now it's already up to 74. It's like 10 degrees warmer than, than it was supposed to be. And it's been sunny all day instead of, you know, like cloudy and possibly raining. So I'm pretty stoked. And that just calls for me to walk around Pleasure House Point. So after I took her home, I went to the bathroom and I grabbed, uh, you know, the, the R4 with the 70 or with the 200 to 600. And I'm going to, I'm going to take a loop and, and just enjoy the day. Then I'll go home and do laundry and sit there. And, and I might actually do day job work today. We'll see. But uh, yeah, so I don't know if I'm going to take this in with me or not, because I just don't feel like carrying a lot of gear. But uh, yeah, Let's head up to Pleasure House Point and see what we can find. All right, kids, that's it. That was pretty fun. I always love walking around here and getting some pictures. There were a ton of pretty much the only thing I saw were yellow crown night herons. So they are back in full force and I couldn't be happier about it. So I got a number of pictures. I did a quick, like not extended loop and it was all great. Now, I am pretty much done with the walking around and doing shit. I'm going to go home and I'm going to eat. And then I'm going to start my Sunday routine, which you don't really need to see anymore. Laundry and quite possibly day job work depends on how long it takes me to edit because I have a lot of stuff that I shot today because it was just an adventure filled day. So that being said, that's all I got for you today, which was a lot. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, kids, forward and up.